Hi y'all, this is gonna be a vlog, a taste test, and showing you a few new art pieces I got. I'm gonna look at the camera. Um, music, uh, a, a canvas I'm gonna frame, a sign, and something else, one other wall art, and um, they're little, and um, I'm gonna taste test this bowl by Gardein, it is vegan, Ultimate plant-based, uh, see the way it says C-H-I-C-K-N, that's vegan chicken, this chicken. Um, plant-based sweet and sour chicken. I've never had plant-based sweet and sour chicken. I'm looking forward to it. 15 grams of protein and only 360 calories. That's really good. And then I'm gonna try this edamame. I've tried frozen edamame before and I didn't like it. This is Pick Sweet. I've never tried this brand. And I think the brand I tried wasn't salted. This has sea salt, it says. I did open it um, to let the steam out because it's really hot, to let some of, to let it cool down. Um, actually, I might put it in the refrigerator and let it cool down later, but um, yeah, I first had edamame in a um, Japanese restaurant with sushi. So let's get these out of the way. And I'll show you the signs first. I'll put this here. And I will take the lid off this. It's really hot. Okay, and I brought some of my uh, really good hot sauce I like. It's Asian. It's made by the same company that makes the famous um, sriracha sauce with the oyster, with the um, the rooster. I checked and it's vegan or vegetarian, but it's made in a factory I think that makes fish, but or shellfish, but I don't care. And this is just. Um, um, Amazon brand, uh, I think I got it with my grocery delivery from Amazon Fresh soy sauce. You could probably buy it on their website too and have it, you know, shipped. But this time I'm gonna open the cap the right way. <laughs> so, uh, and edamame, I'm gonna pour into this bowl. Okay, a little too much. That'll cool it more, it's still really hot. Okay, let me show you the wall art while it's cooling down. So I got this, uh, it hangs on a string. This is from Timu. Uh, Happy Vegetarian Day. I'm gonna put this in my kitchen. And I think it's cute. Um, I think there's a Vegetarian Day one day a year, but I, I searched on there for vegetarian signs and that's what I got. It came with the string. And then I got the Rolling Stones. This is uh, not licensed, but it's from Timu. Um, American Tour 1972 with Stevie Wonder. And it's got Keith Richards and Mick Jagger when they were a lot younger. Mick just turned to 81 recently. So, and then um, I love Guns N' Roses. Of all the rock bands from like the 80s, I love Guns N' Roses from like rock and roll, you know. Not like um, not like punk, like I like Green Day from the 90s, but from the 80s, uh, like I love Guns N' Roses. So this is a canvas I got from Timu and I did buy, it's 12 by eight and I did buy a frame, a black frame on Amazon. So I'm gonna frame it. And I'm gonna put, um, I don't know if you can see, I'm gonna put this. Well, you can see it here, but I'm gonna I'm gonna raise it high, and I'm gonna put it like up here. You can't see it in the camera, but I'm gonna put that up there, and I'm gonna put the sign maybe here below it, or maybe level with this sign. So um, after I frame it, I think that's where I'm gonna put it. So now let's do the taste. Oh, this is a vlog too. You have to check out my shorts, okay? I know those of you who view on a laptop and a desktop and your TV, uh, I don't know about a laptop, uh, laptop and a desktop because I don't use those, but on a TV, it doesn't show shorts, which my shorts are one minute long, the ones I make. But um, um, I've made two. I made one on Halloween that got, it kind of went viral. Like it got like a thousand views really fast. I'm in costume and part of it, kind of like a face costume and a hat and a, um, 
a Halloween shirt with a, it says trick or treat, like at the bottom. <coughs> and um, the new one I just released um, probably like 12 noon today, Pacific time. It's now about 6, 10 Pacific time. And that's gotten quite a few views too, but it's not like viral like that other one on Halloween. So check those out. Um, I think you'll have to go to your phone. I can see shorts on, or go to your community posts. I posted in my community posts. You can get those on your iPad and on your iPhone. I'm sure you can get them on your Amazon, on your Android phone. I don't know about your Android tablets, but I can get community posts on my iPhone tablet. I mean, iPad, iPad, iPad Air tablet. But um, if you watch it on your phone, then you can look at your history on your uh, TV. I've done it on my TV and you can play it on your TV, but replay it. But you can't like look at shorts for the first time. At least I can't with the TV app. I have Roku, so I have the Amazon, I mean, I have the YouTube app. Someone told me that a lot, well, I can tell by my an analysis that a lot of viewers watch me on TV. <laughs> it tells you like, you know, how many, there was a quiz, how many of your viewers watch on TV? And I, I answered it wrong in this 30 day period, but okay, here's what it looks like. The sweet and sour chicken, chicken. It does have rice. I'm going to taste it uh, before I put in the, um, the soy sauce and the hot sauce. If I do, It needs soy sauce and hot sauce. Okay. Oh, it's getting all over the place. Good thing I brought paper towels. Okay. Got my napkin too. Okay. Now let's put um, a little bit of this sambal Olek sauce. Sriracha is not ve vegetarian or vegan. I, I read that, at least by this brand. I don't know if some of it might be because um, other companies make sriracha. This is chili paste. You don't, You can use it on pizza, it says. You don't have to use it on uh, Asian food. I think it's a Vietnamese factory that makes uh, this and sriracha sauce. Okay, now let's taste it. I will taste a piece of the chicken too. Oh, I didn't bring a knife, you guys, to cut it. I'm not gonna leave the leave the screen to get it. So, okay. Let's taste it with the hot sauce and um, some of the soy sauce. Too much hot sauce in that bite. It's a ten, definitely. So this is the Gardein brand. They make all kinds of vegan foods. Okay, I'm a vegetarian, but I eat vegan foods too. Okay, now let's try this edamame. Yeah, they've cooled down, they're still warm. You're, it says you can make them in the microwave and I'm not sure what else, but it's real easy to make in the microwave. Oh, I didn't put another bowl for discarding. Okay, here's what they look like for those of you that haven't seen edamame. It's like a bean, like a pea, it's a legume. Um, peas are legumes, they're not really vegetables. And it's in a little, it's like a pea in a pod, like uh, sweet peas that you can, uh, when I was a little kid, my mom used to buy sweet peas uh, in a pod and we used to open them and eat them raw. Fantastic. Just like the sushi bars. Yep. I'll put it on this paper towel. Fantastic. Okay, so watch my vlogs. I'm gonna do some dancing to music vlogs. I did two, one to a um, um, Halloween song, is the Halloween, the Monster Mash. And um, today I did it to a, gosh, it's left my mind, you guys. Um, Duran Duran, it's a real old Duran Duran from 82 or 81, it's 81. It's really old, it's like when they were new, you know, Duran Duran and I like all their music. 
So I'm gonna do, um, I'm probably gonna do Mustang Sally because if you guys watched me at Rosie's, what was it like two, two and a half years ago, two years ago, two and a half, you saw me dance and a lot of people played, Must several, a few people played Mustang Sally for me because I love Mustangs and I've had um, three. I still, I have a 2022 now. I had two GTs previously and this one's an EcoBoost and I'm still driving, has very low miles. So anyways, uh, anything else I wanna say? Uh, just, yeah, that's it. Just check out my shorts, look on your phone uh, or your community post because sometimes I'll post them because with me, I don't always see shorts, you know, if I'm like looking and I don't always notice them. So, okay. Oh, I got it in my mouth. Oh, and I am wearing makeup. My lipstick probably came off, but in the short, I'm wearing it too. I've been wearing it ever since I did that video um, um, a few days ago, maybe like four or five days ago where I wore foundation for the first time. I'm wearing eyeliner on the bottom and the top. I've been wearing it on the top. Mascara, uh, eyebrow color to make my eyebrows a little darker. And I haven't used the blush yet. It's really like a bronzer. I kind of want to use it in the summer when maybe I'll have a bit of a tan, you know. It's more of a bronzer than a blush. So anyways, I think it's called a bronzer, but I, I bought it as a teenager and I used it as a blush. It's called Indian Clay or Indian Earth. It's really old. I bought it, it's been out since at least the 80s because I used to use it. So um, take care everyone. And um, I'm looking, I know I'm looking at me, but it turns my eyes, but um, Thanks for all the nice comments on my community post and on my, um, my two shorts. Take care. Bye.